Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today I'm going to show you my completed pages for December. Uh, there wasn't that many, I'm not sure how many there were. Let me do a quick look, I don't know where my book is. Anyway, um, I didn't do many in the books I was hoping to work in or finish. I will do a complete colouring wrap up in the next couple of days where I talk about which ones I want to colour in and focus on next year, well this year now, 2024. Um, and what my plans are going forward. Don't worry, there will be lots of videos. I'm just waiting for Jennifer to go back to school. <laughs> it's just very hard to do. Um, she's downstairs with Paul at the moment. So let's have a look at what we coloured. As usual, I've got them in the same piles as um, pictures, colour by numbers, patterns, or pictures, patterns, colour by numbers, and then the books I'm working on to try and finish. But I didn't do many of those. So firstly, I did a buddy colour with Molly Newland. I don't think it was in this one though. It might have been. No, I just did one in this one. Um, what I love about these small Beauty of Horror books is that you can actually use markers, whereas in the, the big ones they are double sided. So you can't. I don't matter if the ink goes through. And I did this one of Guliana standing on top of the chimney, kicking somebody else off. I've done her in the Santa's outfit and the other guy as an elf. Uh, this was using the uh, touch markers from TikTok along with a white Sakura jelly roll pen for the snowflakes. Nice. Didn't bother putting any glisten on the snow. Didn't do it on this one. I usually use the Mod Podge but I haven't on this one. But yeah, I enjoyed doing it. I love these little books. They're fab. I hope he does some more small ones. I like his big ones though. Can't wait for the next one to come out. Then the Christmas colouring book with festive quotes, large print. We did this one in a colouring chat, the only colouring chat we did at Christmas. And we did this one. And this one is, again, done with various markers. I think this was the Windsor Newtons. And a couple of metallic or glitter pens. And some Mod Podge, I don't know if you can see it shining. On the snow to make the snow glisten. But I like that, it's a nice simple book. I'll, I'll hopefully do some more on that next year. I finally did one in the Colouring Heaven Junior Quick and Easy Colouring uh, Christmas one. And I did this one. Of the tree, again, this was using... I'm gonna say it's the, the tip top markers because they're downstairs and I keep them downstairs and use them there. <laughs> This is another cute little book. I'm going to see if it's still available and get one for Jen next year if it is. Um, then I did three with Jennifer. Buddy coloured with Jennifer in this one. Um, hers are up on TikTok. Well, two of hers are up on TikTok. On, not on TikTok. On um, Instagram. So this is 50 Colour uh, Christmas Miniatures by Camellia Angel Cover. The lovely Molly Newland sent both myself and Jennifer a copy of this book for Christmas. And we did this one. Again, this was done using the touch markers from TikTok. We both used them. And then we put some Mod Podge in certain places. As you can see, it's sparkling there on my poinsettia, uh, just to make it sparkle a bit. And then we did the penguins holding the candy canes. This was all done in glitter gel pen, Link Shine glitter gel pen, and the Mod Podge over the white bits to make them sparkle as well. I don't know if you can see it. It's lovely. I love. I love this book. We we really enjoyed colouring in this book together. We did, and we also did the uh, gingerbread man holding the candy cane, um, and the lanterns and the bell. And again, it was just again using the touch markers downstairs from TikTok shop. I'm going to get some more of those when I can. And some Mod Podge on the white bits just to make it sparkle a little bit. So thanks Molly for this book. We really, really actually adore it. We love it. And we've really enjoyed colouring in it together this year. And hopefully we'll do more next Christmas. Uh, I did one in the colour by number Animals by Jade Summer. This is a kind of cute book. I like this book. Sorry, I'm not doing very well today with focusing and this was done up here so this one I know that is the touch new peach I must have had them up here I must have because that is the peach from the touch markers 
Um, but I, I, I got a feeling it was a mixture. I think I started it downstairs and then I carried on up here using, um, I'm going to think now what they're called, a teaser Everblend, Shuttle Arts, my hodgepodge of ones that I'm just using to try and uh, get through. Tell I started downstairs, got that on it. Ah, here's what I did with Molly Newland. Uh, Buddy Colour was Christmas Patterns Colour by Number. We are doing one in seasons, but I haven't finished it yet. And we did this one. Hello, Zed. The cat's here. Hello, darling. Uh, that's what the shadow is on the book, if you're wondering. It's the cat. So, again, this was done with the... Markers from TikTok Shop. You're going to get that a lot at the moment because I really do like them. I enjoyed this book. It's really nice. Then I did one in Christmas Mandala colour by number by Astachin Sachdeva and I'm doing them in order so this time it was this one. We went through this one. Uh, this was done using, excuse me, the Boldmere markers from the works, Arteza Everblend and my box of hodgepodge markers that are just everywhere basically. Uh, colour by number Christmas. This is Jade Summer, so I got this one out to do one. I always want to do more than one, but I just don't have the time at Christmas. Where is it? I will see. I was going to do the next one. I was going to do this one. Put put the paper. Don't do that one. Put the paper in and everything. Didn't get around to it. And I did this one. And this was done using the TikTok markers. Cause I did downstairs. Didn't take very long at all. Quite enjoyed that one. It was really nice. Yeah, I'm going quite fast, I am sorry. Um, I did one in Adult um, 100 Magical Patterns by Jade Summer. Now this one, I've got to be honest, is one I started a couple of months ago and just never got around to finishing it. It was just sitting there waiting for me to finish it. And I do love colouring these pictures when I get to it. <sighs> sorry. As you can see, that went through. Here we go. Uh, this was using the Bic markers, the Bic's Kids colour markers. And I started it, I started it up here and it just sat. So yeah, this has just been uh, hanging around for a while because I was doing other things. But I finished it off and there we go. So now onto the only two pages I did of the books I wanted to finish last year. I didn't finish. I only finished the two which you saw. I will do a, a video later explaining what my plan is for 2024 colouring. What I achieved. So a sort of wrap up video of what I achieved colouring wise in 2023. Um, what I achieved on Instagram. How many videos etc etc. So I just got to work all that out and then I'll, I'll do it. And then I will tell you exactly what I hope to achieve with the colouring and videos um, and Instagram every month or every, you know, I don't know what I'm saying, throughout 2024. So which books I'm going to be focusing on. Um, I'm definitely going to be continuing with the ones that I haven't done. So there's eight books that are being brought over for this year. And I'm going to find another two just to add. So the first one is Chelsea's book. Now, I'm going to be honest. I've only got one page left in here to do. So I will be finishing that potentially January. Now there are duplicates in this book. Um, but I did, ooh, that was very good, didn't I? Put it in the wrong page. Doesn't matter. Uh, but Jennifer will be uh, having those ones. So this is the one I did. And these, I, the eyeshadow it, are those new markers. And so I think it's the red here. These flowers and the background are the link shines and I use the touch markers from TikTok shop. Blusher is my bold mirror pastels. Pastels. We're very easy to use. I like using them. They just give it a nice hint. It looks really nice. Um, but yeah, I've really enjoyed this book, Chelsea. I really have, to be honest. I've really enjoyed it. And I know Jennifer's enjoyed colouring the pages she's scribbled on so far but I know she will colour them later so this book I'll probably keep intact because there's only a few doubles but uh, and the only other one I did one in is the Jade Summer oh ow I've pulled one of my intercostal muscles and I'm in pain so 
yeah is the 50 easy patterns from Jade Summer and I just got a load of um, link shines coloured in that's all it is just link shine I love my link shines I'm on image 25 there are 50 I'm probably not going to complete it this year but we'll have a go we'll see how we can get done it's nice to work on a book with the intention of finishing it but it doesn't matter if you don't when it comes down to it as long as we're enjoying what we're colouring that's all that matters but that's it that's everything I coloured in December and I did enjoy it I enjoyed what I did colour I will finish off um, that buddy colouring seasons Molly don't worry I have started it it's just that I, I got a bit stuck <laughs> but I will I will of course finish it so I will be back soon with my wrap up um, a video of 2023 and what I want to achieve books I want to complete or work through in 2024 not necessarily going to actually finish them but what I want to work in um yeah and I will see you in that video very very soon so have a lovely evening day whatever time of day it is wherever you are in the world I love you all thanks for sticking by me I've had some pretty tough times in 2023 um I hope it gets better and I'll see you all soon